we're here with the Blade 400. This is the Castle Creations Phoenix 835 speed control set in governor mode. It's high governor. I'm running stock battery. I'm running a CC BEC that's set up at 5.5 volts. The uh, cyclic servos are DSP 75s, Spectrum servo. It's uh, not the same as the uh, stock servo and there's a 3400G on the tail with a 401 gyro. Other than that everything else is stock. Not much left is stock. Okay this is a little different. I've got this set up on a DX7 and what we'll do is we'll go ahead and turn on the DX7 okay and then after it comes on we're going to come over here and flip off and go to the throttle hold. And then the reason is that's actually set up above idle and that way the speed control won't arm until after I set it down. The only bad thing with that is once you set down and you turn it off it you can't disarm it you have to hold the throttle down so that's kind of the key with that. Alright, uh, I'll plug this thing in, I'll get tones. I'm going to have to turn the camera off to do that because I don't have enough hands. So uh, I'll plug it in, I'll get tones, wait for it to initialize, put the canopy on and then the next scene will be set up, uh, ready to fly. We'll spool. We'll. You'll hear it. You'll hear, hear the ESC arm. So we'll spool it up and we'll hover it. Uh, I can only do this with a fixed camera because I don't have any help. So here's what we got. All right. Get the heli down. We're gonna arm it. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. Throttle low. Hit the switch. Heli's armed. Now all we gotta do is pull, push it up to half throttle and let it spool up. This is set on number nine on the pull-up speed. You can see it takes a while, but wait for it to stabilize. And right there, we're good. So now we can lift off. Okay, as you can see, hover's pretty good. Yes, it's snowing. It's cold as all get out out here. But anyway, that's uh, Blade 400 with the Phoenix 80, Phoenix 35. Uh, get somebody to shoot some video, and we'll get some flying of it flying around.